Ben, an adventure for Wendy. The hmm. Peter Pan and the Lost Boys love visiting, listening to Wendy's bedtime stories. Tinkerbell to never miss to a telling. They all did like looking in at her gripping tales of western and the pirates, hidden treasures, and magical pack of pixie dust. See? With my pixie quick kids, she gets dust. See you guys got good and many of them in here. Tuck and we're gonna there. But one night during his story time, the lost boys all are gonna look at the board. Even Michael and John found her get her sisters as take dough. Please tell us a new story, Michael said. Where will I find the, the explanation for the bread and bread story? Wendy wondered aloud. Then it came to her the Wendy story, Wendy's bedtime story. All started Peter Pan. All she needed to, for a brand new story was a, an adventure with Peter. Maybe that's what been fast and fast. What's been a new talking in bed? The next morning, Wendy bounded out of the bed, ready to join Peter Pan on a, an exciting excursion. But Peter was in Norway, so you could who could be found. I'm sorry, old chap. John, uh, John said, pushing her up his glasses. I saw Peter and the Tink leaving. It's turning early uh, for the firm all day this morning. You need Peter Pan to have an adventure, said the Nips. What will you do, Wendy? Tucked his horses. It was true. Peter was always the dare daring hero of Wendy's story. But Wendy wasn't horses. Now, boys, don't you worry, said Wendy. <laughs> I'll just have to create my own story. The own adventure story. The lost boys looked at dresses. But Wendy was to dream. I'll head for the sea, he said. There's always a venture to be had there. There on my there. It's your lucky dragons. There on my exactly with them. Wendy took a a shortcut through the jungle on her way to the to the water. She ran under the rushing waterfall, skipped over the stepping stones, and breaking the strangers. <laughs> oh, that led them in the river. Then she go look at up the up to the sea and her nearest her family racing. Between the trees. That looks looks like a, a grand time, exclaimed Wendy. Founding an adventure and could gonna wait a little while longer, I'm sure. Woo 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 this is a scary guy that I have a lot to see. So Wendy joined to the fun of adventure, and and the gorgeous one high above the ground, from the tree to tree to tree, of which I could spend all day with you," said Wendy when and everyone to he stopped to rest. But I'm in the string of an adventure. She wouldn't not let the, the lost boys down. When he said goodbye to her new friends, then headed the towards the present and did that me to stay. Well, that's why we're making. They are no way to see the buggy to see the purple of I know. <gasps> As Wendy skipped to pass the shimmery mermaid movement, she heard that someone cried out, Help! The mermaid, the little mermaid is still. Real on my head, I can look like a thing must be. Oh dear, gasped Wendy. A mermaid was stuck in a fishing net. net. Her friends were swimming in nowhere to the beast queen. Finding a bedtime story would have a good two word wait once again. Wendy dove into the water, swam toward the mermaid, and rescued her from the net. Oh, I can't okay. There we go. This is a ticket of the fish. Ooh, I got to take it my heart. I got to take it from training. 
thank you for saving me, stresses the mermaid. You're so brave. You want to stay and play in the lunken for a while. Wendy and the mermaid splash and laugh in the water. This is so much fun, cried Wendy as she came up from a dip in the cove. But I really must be going. I still have something to find in my adventure. She left her mermaid friend and went off in the seat of the, her bedtime story. <sighs> There's Cedar again. Oh! He's a lost and the lost and the being a little room with a little hiding. <gasps> Wendy hiked along the, the coast. Past blind of land, so blind to get heading toward the little rowboat. Looking at, at the dock, once she reached the, the boat, Wendy fought as she could to finally start to her adventure. Then she to have a bedtime story to tell. The wind! Wendy arrived at the boat. She found the thing she trying to steal it. Her bedtime story <laughs> would have to wait. She couldn't let the same steam to take to the lost boys the boat. Hi, Seagar. This is where they found the found the name. <gasps> now seems you believe that that's the boat alone, warned Wendy. It belongs to the lost boys. The pirates granting you have to find the me for the it the first little lass. You challenge Wendy under the whip sea is using all the sword skills that she to learn to from Peter and a feel of her tricks of her own. It is his victory was a of the using of the was the boat. Her adventure could finally begin. Ah ha ha! Sure, the big bigger than the big come. But as Wendy looked into to, to, to the sky, she saw the, the sun was setting on the horizon. It was time to head back. Wendy returned to the, the hideout. Feeling different, she felt to have an adventure. There would be no new bedtime story that night. She stood outside the hideout. Knowing her new friends would be extremely listening to the same of old bedtime story. There's always tomorrow, she thought after she climbed into the hideout. Hey, be find out. Look at this. So easy, so easy. But it gets a really, really easy being. <gasps> when the lost boys captured around, Wendy extreme. I'm sorry, boys. I meant to do half a thing of Mexican adventure today. But instead, I squint through the trees with extension to save the mermaid and effect of the uh, the parrot. The lost boys listened in awe. Peter Pan was extended, swinging from the trees, swimming in the lagoon, just to get to see. Oh, that's right, that's right, that's right, it's here. <sighs> I think this one is she does. She wouldn't she in the air. This is she does. <gasps> oh, oh, Wendy, what a stringy day that you all had, Peter exclaimed. <laughs> you are so cautious, said John. The lost boys all agreed it was the best bedtime story Field ever heard. Hooray for Wendy, said Peter, looking back at her on her day. Wendy frisked her kid the day, but we're right. She frisked her, her own her avenger. All by herself. What a wonderful feeling! Oh, just as a just as you guys make when we're in my look at my log a little bit of the lost. <laughs> that night, Wendy snuggled into her warm bed, dreaming, dreaming about all the day, the, the big adventures she had the next day. Maybe because he's sticking, he's sticking it out, he's sticking it out. 